Getting started on Skype is easier than you might think. A simple software download, then sign up for an account, and you're ready to Skype. First, we will open Internet Explorer and type in our destination URL, www.skype.com. Once the page loads, we will go to Get Skype and then choose our computer download type. There are two account versions of Skype to choose from. For most people, the free account will work for their needs. Now we will click Download Skype. Your installation should begin automatically. On the first pop-up, we'll choose Run. You may now be asked if you would like to let Skype make changes to your computer. We'll choose Yes. From here, we can select our desired language, read the user agreement and privacy policy, and then click I agree. Install. Depending on your computer speed, this installation can take a few minutes. Once it is finished, we will minimize the window and click on the new Skype icon on our desktop. To set up a new account, we will click Don't have a Skype name? This will take us to the Create New Skype Account window, where we will fill out our information. This includes name, Skype name, password, and email address. Skype will automatically recommend a username based on your real name. If you don't like it, feel free to type in your own. It is important to enter in correct and complete information to make it easy for your friends to find you. If you don't want to receive Skype emails, uncheck this box. Once we have entered all of the information, we will click I agree, create account. Then we can set up the information that will be available to others. This information is optional, but again, it will help your friends find you. You may want to uncheck the box to have Skype sign you in automatically if you share a computer. Now we will click OK. Skype has many tools to help you get started, and you can click on any of these options to help you get started using your new account. Now we are ready to add our friends and get started with our new Skype account.